All right, guys, welcome back to more PS5 Master League Reebok Stadium is where we are today for Bolton away. So, uh, yeah, it's kind of nice, actually, because we're getting a little bit of a break um, for the next couple of weeks because we have no midweek matches this week and next week. Yay, rest. Got a lot of a lot of players do need rest. Uh, I think, was it Checkers returned, Shimizu, and was the other one Heitinger? Um, they've got a lot of fatigue, so they're going to be uh, resting up for the next couple of weeks at least, anyway. Uh, for this one today, um, well, let, let's just bat a Bolton, please. That <laughs> That's what I want to happen today. Um, because, well, obviously we're trying to win the title. Um, but also... Um, Bolton are like on sitting on 20 points in the league this season, so they're not doing too well. Uh, Mascherano is in there, just wanted to say that. Here's Mutu. Oh, he nearly got his way through there. There's Ben Naim, here's um, O'Brien. Um, so, yeah, there's that. And it's Mutu. It's Mutu. He's absolutely fluffed that. Yeah, that was, that was not like Mutu, that. Here's Risa. It's going to be Mafio. It's going to be Mutu again. It's going to be Torres. It's Torres' shot. That's gone wide. Yeah, Torres is starting this one because uh, he's on a red form arrow. And Ronaldo's just been really weird this season, to say the least. I don't know what to say about Ronaldo, if I'm honest. He's just not been himself. Um... So we're not going to play... Well, he's on the bench, Ronaldo, but we're going to start Torres based on that red form arrow. Um, and that's as simple as it gets, really, uh, with that. So, yeah, here's Gerard, here's Torres. We've got a lot of men on the ball here. Looking pretty nice. Here's Mutu. And it's Iniesta, and there's the goal. It just felt like that was going to happen pretty soon the way we were going about it we just were going all in full strength as we can be and just let's take this game to Bolton today let's just let's just get in there you know and I I Iniesta's delivering so far that's what I'm trying to say pretty good shot that to be fair um Mutu providing the assist on this one he, he gets a little bit tripped there but then just smacks this ball right across the face of goal and in and that is 1-0 already, so that's a very good start. I think Manchester United are at Wigan today, and I think Chelsea are playing West Brom. So, yeah, we are, what are we, five points ahead of United now? I mean, it's looking really good for us, but we need to keep it up. Let's get this title won soon, is uh, is the idea, if we can. So, yeah. Um, I think we've, we're having so much better in this second half of the season. Like, I just feel like the season is going so much more better. Um, so yeah, here is Iniesta, and, oh, set up nicely for Gerard. oh, what is the keeper, <laughs> what is that by the keeper, what is that dive, it's like a backwards dive or something, I don't know what's going on there, that is strange and everything, I don't know what to tell you. Oh, yeah, Chivu's starting this one as well. Uh, obviously, because Heitinger is uh, missing. Mafio's taken the ball out of play there by accident. We've got uh, Gambino on the bench. We were going to... Oh, oh, it's Mutu. It's... Back with Mutu. Oh, he's trying to play in... To you know what? Mutu should have just taken the shot. He's trying to play in Torres there and be a little bit clever. But uh, that didn't work out. Uh, what was I going to say? Um, I lost my train of thought now, but yeah. <laughs> so, Bolton's passing's a little bit tricky in today's game, I have to say that. Uh, I don't know, I feel like we're winning the ball pretty easily off them. I mean, they're just playing it around here. Not causing too much of an issue. Reese is going to have to get back now. As I say that, so that's bad. And stopped there by Risa. Nicely done. Oh, Mascherano with that there. Here he goes. Here he goes. Here's Mutu. It's Iniesta. Finds Mutu. Mutu. Oh. 
unlucky that time took the shot on that time as well that's a, an offside <laughs> right there by a, what in the hell is that name not even going to try it not even going to pronounce that one yeah not 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 even going to go with that <laughs> you know no no offense or anything to the guy but i'm just not even going to try that one Here's Mutu, and it's Mutu, and, ah, I mean, Torres, he, he could have maybe picked Torres out there, potentially, that's going nowhere. Steven Gerrard, with another shot in this game, <laughs> what's going on there? It's Mafio, it's Mutu, and stopped here. Well, Bolton had that miracle season a few seasons back, didn't they? Where um, they were like bottom all season, pretty much. And then they win the last four games of the season in a row and stay up. And it was like, I, I can't even still to this day explain what happened there. It was pretty, pretty crazy, to say the least. Here is Chivu. I mean, this, this match has been all us, to be honest, which is good. Here is Mutu. He's got Torres in support. It's Mutu, he didn't need Torres. 2-0 is the score. Let's go, boys. I think we're playing excellently today. I, I have to say that. I feel like we're just so, like, I don't know, focused on the ball. Nice little finish there by Muto. I know it's very basic, you know, what I'm describing here I, I suppose you could call it but just this little just yeah that's all it needed found the target and then just slotted it beyond the keeper I think our next game is against Newcastle if I remember correctly um, so we oh god remember last time we played Newcastle Ugh, I don't want to remember it <laughs> But, um, I don't know, I feel like we're playing better now. I'm feeling more confident about taking on teams like Newcastle, etc. The team I don't want to play this season is Manchester United in the uh, Champions League final, potentially, if we make it that far. But I could see that pretty much happening. <laughs> Here is Mafio. And he's got a corner out of it. And he's going to take this. And doesn't find anyone. Here is Risa. And he's got a free kick out of it as well. And you know what? Iniesta's going to pop this in. Oh, it was heading for Mafio. Here's Risa. Nice save. Steven Gerrard misses the target. You know, I think it was season... Oh, was it season two? I want to say where Risa scored against Bolton. I think it was the away game. And it was a pretty good hit from, uh, I believe, like outside the box. And I think we won that game, like, 2-1 or something. I don't remember too well, but it was a, a well-hit ball. Had that confidence there to take it on. Half-time approaching here. I don't want this half to end, honestly. I think, I think we're having a really good game. Honestly, I, I don't want this to end. Um, I don't think Marshall and goals had anything to do. In fact, in fact, I don't even think I mentioned Marshall. I, you, we could go all game and, and you would never know he was in goal at this rate. Half time is here. So we United won Celtic nil at half time and also uh, Tottenham won Arsenal nil at half time. So uh, the guy I can't pronounce has come off now for Duf. So that's something. Which I think is two substitutes they've used now with Bolton, haven't they? I believe. So yeah, because so, uh, the We United game is a big game down at the bottom. Because I think We United are currently dead last, aren't they, in the league? It's, uh, it's looking pretty strange for the for their standards usually hanging around the European spots, but not so this season. So a big three points there for We United if they can keep that up. 
Ooh, Gerard brought down there. Here's Mascherano. Here's Mafio. Finds Risa. Finds Mutu. What a save. That's a fantastic save, honestly. Mutu just takes a touch and then takes the uh, the shot there. That's headed clear. Here's Sinclair. And nicely stopped there. Here's Gerard. I think the idea is is a full strength team is out today. Full strength team will be out in the next one. And then probably the one after, and then we're going to rest up because we've got We United coming up um, in the uh, in the cup second leg, which is a three nil lead we've got in that one. So we're going to be resting the entire team up pretty much uh, for that. And Gerard takes this shot. You know what? Why not? He uh, he had a little bit of space to work. He could have squeezed it in at that near post potentially, but maybe not to be. Feeling very uh, confident today with our shot. We've had a few long shots here and there. And uh, Gerard doesn't find his pass through to Torres. We are going to go back to Marshall. Who's uh, is that like his first touch? He's had all game, Marshall, or something. Like he he's been very um, quiet, if I'm honest. But uh, you know, I was th thinking about the uh, the goalkeeper situation and check and everything this season. And to be honest. I think what we're going to do is we're going to assess the situation towards the end of the season. And... Oh! Where did that come from? Riso with a cracking goal there. I think it was a header. What a goal, man. <laughs> well, it just comes in. I think it comes off the bar as well. Because I heard, I heard the bar get smacked. Gerard just fires this in, and Reese is there, and it comes off the bar and in, and the goalkeeper's just like, eh, I don't know what to do here. That's, that's insane. <laughs> that's insane. I don't even know what my train of thought was. Oh yeah, something to do with the goalkeepers. I think like what we're going to do is assess the goalkeeper situation in the summer because we don't know. I don't know what to do with Czech. I think by the start of next season, Czech has been with us about eight seasons. So I mean, we've got what we wanted out of him. That's for sure. You know, he's he's done a job definitely. But uh, some of the performances this season have just been quite questionable. So it's it's just like... Mm. Gambino, Nuri Sahin and, and Cafu on, by the way. Um, I think Gambino's actually got the, uh, the captain's armband. He won't have it for very long, though. But, um, you know, it's, it's a debate because I think Oscar Cordoba's like 24 or something right now. So it's a debate of like, oh, do we scour the market and see like what goalkeepers are available during the summer? See if there's a, an even younger goalkeeper than Cordoba maybe to uh, to take on potentially. Here's Mutu. It's Mutu who misses. And that was a fantastic opportunity to extend his lead for the Golden Boot, but not to be. You know, or do we just stick with Czech for another season or something? Because I feel like Marshall is doing a really good job anywhere um, when he's called upon. Like, he's had a couple of, um, I'd say, pretty good games. I, I don't know about the last game. Like, he's he, he had questionable positioning in the last game, to be fair, <laughs> um, in the Arsenal one on the goal we could 
conceded. But other than that, he's been Mr. Reliable for many seasons. And that Everton game, he pulled off about, I don't know, was it about three good, really good saves, if I remember correctly. So uh, there's that. But um, it kind of reminds me when we bought Buffon, though, um, a few seasons ago. And I was, I was really excited about Buffon. Uh, I'm really excited about this pass here from Mafio into Gambino. Oh, oh, shame that uh, couldn't have ended up in a goal. Oh, we got the corner out of it. <laughs> and, oh, Nuri Sahin's head there, but it's taken out of play. Um, we got Buffon. He just kept making so many little mistakes, like that Ajax game in the uh, Champions League, the first leg. In the, it was a semi-final game. Um... And uh, he just let the ball go. And it just allowed Ajax for a tap-in um, at one point. And uh, we ended up losing that game 2-1. I think that wasn't it like two very big goalkeeping errors that, that were made that night. I can't remember. But um, yeah, it was just like, you, you know, it, it, it was clear that Buffon just wasn't cut out for the team at that point. <laughs> and he had to go. But Czech is starting to make some errors. Oh, which are, I'm just makes me question him a little bit. Torres here with a shot. You know, Torres hasn't really seen a lot of the ball today. I don't. I, I feel like we don't need. You know what? I feel like we, you could take Torres out of this team today. We could have played this match with ten men and still got the same result. Honestly, I do feel like that. I feel like we've played that good. We didn't even need him. And, oh, nice win of the ball there by Mutu. But he's got to keep it going. He's got to keep it going. It's Mutu. It's Mutu. It's... Are you serious? He could have literally just soloed that all the way there. And he totally fluffs the shot in the end. That is unbelievable. I honestly thought, is he going to finish this here? I mean, the guy's already a legend enough as it is without doing stuff like that, <laughs> you know. But Bolton just couldn't keep up with him there. I mean, even at his age, 36, he's still doing it, man. Like, I tell you, I'm, 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 I'm nervous about Mutu. Like, he's when he retires, man, I'm just going to cry for, like, a whole day. Or, or maybe a few weeks, even. But he did add one to his tally for this season. Arisa with that head, that, what was that? That was insane. <laughs> um... Fantastic game, no issues. See, what's interesting here is if um, Mutu started the game not as the captain, but in the replays, he's actually the captain at a time when he wasn't, which is kind of interesting. But this, this here, I'm just like, eh, what is that? <laughs> what is that? That's lovely stuff, that's what that is. Just like, rock it in, boom, done. But uh, yeah, Mutu, the man of the match there. And apparently he was the captain when he scored the first goal, even though he wasn't. <laughs> Just a little thing that I've actually never noticed until now. Had no clue it did that in the re replays of this game. Uh, just a minor error on the uh, uh, devs part, I guess. A bit, a bit of go how the game is uh, developed and programmed, etc. But yeah, um, call it what you want. But uh, yeah, d did Marshall even have to do anything? I don't remember a single dangerous attack. <laughs> that um that Bolton had honestly today fast tear came on did he okay I didn't even remember that um but it just like we put out a full strength team and we didn't even need it really but it was best to throw it out there anyway and like I said we got a break this week for midweek so uh yeah 7.5 for Risa yeah, I'd probably give it to Muto. I think he was probably the best out there. Mafio was amazing, though. He was providing them balls up to Muto. So was Risa. Maybe even Risa, man of the match, potentially. He was so good. He got a goal for himself. And he could have had two. He did have that shot at goal in the uh, first half. Uh, I thought Gerard was really good today as well. He was unlucky, though, with his, some of his shots, etc. Iniesta, again, really good. Got the opening goal. Torres, six. Probably he couldn't. He, you know, you know what? Tech Marshall out and Tech Torres out, and we could have still probably won this with nine men. That's what it felt like. It did. No disrespect to Bolton, but man, we were pretty damn good today. Mutu's stats are actually pretty close to improving as well. Some of them, <laughs> which is uh, it's kind of a scary thought to be honest. But uh, yeah, this is what fixture twenty-two threw up today. 
Um, sorry, that that's kind of a, that's kind of graphic, that isn't it? Why did I say throw up? That was a weird way of putting it. Um, but yeah, uh, Rangers 2-1. They beat Newcastle away. Well, that's something we couldn't do earlier in the season. Uh, Chelsea lose to West Brom 3-2 at home. So is that Chelsea's title hopes over? It looks to be. Uh, Charlton and Birmingham was 2-2. Manchester United win comfortably at Wigan 4-1. Uh, Arsenal lose at Tottenham 2-0. Everton lose at Blackburn 1-0. And we United and Celtic ended up being 1-1. Celtic saved a point. So this is what the top half of the table looks like. Our Rangers on the comeback to get back into a European position now. We will find out. No changes though in the top six. Um, so yeah, that's about as much as I can say there for the time being. In. Everton have dropped down to 8 from 30 points they are on uh, no changes for Celtic or We United there the, the, I mean they got both got a point so it's something um, I mean we beat Bolton they've gone down to 14th now Wigan are down to 13th but they're on 20 points along with Bolton so it's really really tight but massive win for Blackburn today puts them on 23 uh, massive win as well for West Brom today well done to them they're on 25 points you know, they're, they're near enough just about there as, as, as time slowly begins to run out. So Mafia and Iniesta have actually both provided seven assists in the league this season for us. They're both joint second in the league for assists. I think it's Duff who's on nine or something. But yeah, this is fixture 23 coming up for you next time. Look at this. No midweek game. Just another league fixture for you. Um... So yeah, we've got Charlton against Bolton, Everton against Wigan, Chelsea travel to Blackburn, Blackburn just needing a few more points to survive, Chelsea's title hopes are pretty much just about over, aren't they? Um, we United, they travel to Spares, that's going to be tough, because Spares are in European position and we United are near the bottom, well, uh, uh, are they 15th or 16th We United, I can't remember, but uh, yeah, Birmingham... Uh, against uh, Rangers. West Brom, they just beat Chelsea. Could they do it at Manchester United? We're hoping so. Fingers crossed. And Celtic with a tough, tough uh, fixture at Arsenal. So, yeah, for us, it's Newcastle. We got the lead. It was pretty tough when we went to Newcastle earlier in the season. We got the lead, but then we think we let in. Was it a stupid own goal or something ridiculous? Or was it was it Messi who scored against us? Because I think he's at, he's at Newcastle still, isn't he? I want to say it was messy. <laughs> um, I can't remember. Maybe I'll look back at that one another time. But uh, yeah, Newcastle, tough game. Got to win it. Got to be in it. I think we were absolutely excellent today. No worries. Defensively, we didn't really need to do an awful lot, which uh, I think says a lot. So uh, join us for that one next time, guys. Correct, subscribe, and share as always. If you want to, see you then. Take care.